I am so 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 happy it was suggested to me. Oh, it's it feel like oh it's sticky, you know it's like oh it's like oh will you try this on your face? You try this on your face. Must be some high polarplex big deal oil. I use so much oil. Hello and welcome. Hi, I'm Sachya and welcome to my YouTube channel. So the last time I had uploaded a video trying out hyped up skincare and all of these lipsticks, I got a lot of comments with suggestions on what products I should try. So I listened to you guys and to all the suggestions from my friends on what I should try next. So let's see, did you make me waste my money or was it totally worth it? The product that was most highly recommended was this Aqualogica Radiance plus dewy sunscreen in which has watermelon and niacinamide. A lot of you refer to it as the pink color uh, Aqualogica sunscreen uh, because I had tried the um, orange one and I found it quite thick uh, and a bit greasy for my skin. But this one, I have to tell you, is quite good. It's quite light, like it, it looks creamy, but it has a very nice light finish, like it, absorbs easily into the skin it doesn't leave a white cast and it has like a nice i don't know if you can see on camera like that glow but it leaves a really nice light glow on my skin um and for its price of 399 for this and you always get it on a discount on amazon i think it's totally worth it and a great sunscreen to try out so thank you okay so someone suggested that i try out this product which is the advanced stale 96 mucin power essence from C-O-S-R-X, I don't know how to pronounce it. Is it Cosrx? Cosrx? I don't know, but what I do know is that this product is really good. I've actually had this for a while now, I think about a year and a half. Um, and I've, you've seen probably a lot of people on social media, like when they show you, it's all about the crazy factor, like, oh, it's, it smells like, oh, it's sticky, you know, it's like, oh, it's like, oh, will you try this on your face? You try this on your face? But honestly, like that's the last thing you think about when you're applying it because this is so hydrating and so light. Like if you have oily skin like me and you want something to hydrate your face but you don't feel it too clogged and too heavy at night, especially hot summer nights where you're going to be sweating, this is perfect. Like when you just apply it, it's a very light layer and it feels like not sticky like a gel. It's like you're putting water but it's like an extremely watery gel. It doesn't feel too sticky and when you wake up your thin skin feels like really soft and nice like i had it like i said for a year and a half but you need just like one or two drops so this lasts for a really long time um it's totally worth the price i'll put the price down here it's a little expensive but for the kind of product you get and the quantity you get totally worth it um on that note i have to mention that i use it with this a uh, BHA blackhead power liquid from the same company, uh, this cost company. I have used the Paula's Choice 2% BHA liquid because I had a lot of blackheads and I needed, you know, a non-invasive thing to get it dissolved and removed. And Paula's Choice unfortunately didn't work for me. It's worked for a lot of people, a lot of people swear by it, but for me it was like nothing happened and it was quite expensive so i felt light down but this again like you see how much of product is there i use this once or twice a week you're not supposed to use it more than that because um two percent bha can be quite harsh on your skin and the next day you have to apply um you know sunscreen with it uh this has been really good for my skin i feel like i do feel like my blackheads have gotten smaller it doesn't like immediately vanish but if you use it for a couple of weeks to see that yes you, you see it like getting dissolved it doesn't leave marks on your face when your blackheads go so i usually first apply this let it dry a bit and then i apply this uh, because i feel like they complement each other and in the morning when you wash your face like it's a really nice feeling when you use both of these together the next product is another skincare product and this wasn't a suggestion but someone had left a comment about what can i do with acne marks and um, you know you can try the traditional ones of using haldi and curd uh, i haven't used that a lot because my skin tone is already yellowish and if i use it i become like a minion i found that this one by uh, paula's choice it's the 10 percent azelaic acid booster this has really helped me um this is a really you can see it's like a really tiny tube and it costs i remember it was very expensive 3240 it's mentioned on this but i remember i got it on amazon at a much lower price um and that was the only reason i bought it but this is so good um i've had 
times where I've you know picked my own face and so the, it's left marks even here like this mark that you see it was much darker um, and I start using this and it fades it really really well so if there is a product that um, I would say is expensive but totally works it's this you don't have to necessarily buy it but if you were looking to buy it um, you can keep like I would recommend like it, it helps with it and it you need just like one one dot because it's pot and you're not putting it all over for your face you just need one drop put it on your face and again like I have quite a bit of product I think it will last me for another year I think I hope I hope I don't get you know so many like acne marks that I need to use it that often so the next thing is this chemist at play uh, daily exfoliating body wash um, which has 4% lactic acid salicylic acid and vitamin E now uh, lactic acid and salicylic acid have always worked great for my skin because I have oily skin so my skin gets clogged so I need something to unclog it and vitamin E is quite nourishing like I remember I had a vitamin E face wash from body shop which was amazing like it worked so well for my skin so i was happy to see these ingredients and i remember another influencer had recommended this on her stories this was i think the rebel kit she had said this was really good for strawberry skin which i'm guessing is like um you know when you shave and then the hair grows back it looks like strawberry seeds um i don't have such a huge problem with that but i do know that on my back i have a bit of clogged pores and also um I thought this would also help with underarm because I'm scared to put the glycolic acid on my underarm and burn it. So um, this was like really good. Okay, I will show you. Oh, oh wait, backstory. This was so difficult to open. I, uh, it was just not pumping. I don't know, it was because I carried on it on the flight towards Singapore and um, just wasn't opening. I had to finally watch a YouTube video to learn how to pump this open so I finally figured it out and now it's like this it looks creamy it's not like that thick creamy this does foam a bit oh and it smells really nice it smells like a strawberries and cream kind of smell like it the smell is really good on the instructions it says that you can use it on a loofah or plain um, I've tried to use it on a loofah but because it doesn't foam much it doesn't really um, give me that body wash feel so I use it directly and it also has some granules in it. it it has something that gives it like a little exfoliating kind of feel so I feel like when I use it directly I can get that exfoliation better uh, this smells great uh, the scent lingers on your body for a while so especially like if you sweat a lot like me um, and you want your armpits to smell well or smell good uh, this definitely that smell is really pleasant it's been very good for my sensitive skin I've had no issues Issues. Uh, exfoliating removing board strawberry skin I haven't experienced that I don't know but in everything else this ticks my boxes and it's a great body wash this next product I am so 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 happy it was suggested to me because it is a bomb product this is the plum matte in heaven liquid lipstick so someone had suggested actually to try the bullet lipstick not the liquid lipstick but I misread the comment and I'm glad I did this is the color that I'm wearing on my lips right now it's litchy licious and this is almost exactly like the Maybelline Superstay but at half the price this was I think like 400 rupees or something this lasts really long it's very pigmented I love the shade like this is exactly like the shade that I love to wear and at this price point man it is so good like I love this if you are looking for a long lasting liquid lipstick that is transfer proof um, gives great pigment and all of those things then definitely try this matte plum matte in heaven liquid lipstick the next liquid lipstick that i was asked to try out or i don't know if someone asked me or i was just curious to try this is the simply nam uh simply nam uh, liquid lipstick it's the comfort wear matte lipstick in the shade tanya which is a coral rose uh simply nam is an indian brand it's by the makeup artist Namrata Sony and I was very excited to try an Indian brand for a liquid lipstick because I thought you know it would be formulated for our skin tone better so I tried it one day and I wore it for an entire day to give you guys a peek into like how long it lasts etc so I'm gonna put the video here this is what the applicator looks like wow the color is really pretty and it's quite pigmented like I had to do only one dip and swipe I didn't have to keep reapplying um, let me see how it dries out and how it lasts through the day, but yeah, pretty color. 
So now you know it's good, but it's not as long lasting as the plum liquid lipstick, but um, comfort on the lips, it's quite nice. The only problem with this lipstick is the pricing, which is among the higher range of liquid lipsticks that I've tried so far. Now this product is something that was not recommended, but I've seen it so much on social media and this was gifted to me on my birthday. This is the Olaplex number no. seven bonding oil. And this was, I thought, hey, must be some hype, Olaplex, big deal oil, I've used so much oil. Okay, first of all, it's a very light oil, okay? And I'll just put it and demonstrate it for you. It's a very light oil. Um, it's not heavy and then you just do this and then you just I usually after my hair dries I just usually put it on my hair like this just to you know remove any frizz and the smell is so good like you smell you smell elegant you smell put together and your hair looks shiny and soft so if you've been considering and investing in an expensive product then this I will tell you is like worth it it's worth your money and like you just need one drop so this will last a very long time very very nice like i love it this is another product that i've been seeing a lot of a lot of influencers use it a lot of influencers talk about it and this is the instant aged rewind eraser 130 medium that's my shade so i really like this because usually when i put concealer it tends to crease and this one like because of this powder puff application Okay, let me show you because of this kind of applicator like i feel like it really goes really well into my skin you just have to do like this like this like this for me to make the product go and then i just do one two three and you can just like it just blends beautifully into your skin if you are someone like me who doesn't um have a lot of makeup brushes or you don't have a lot of time for like face makeup this is like a two-in-one very good it just blend so beautifully into your skin so highly highly recommend now the last product um that i want to show you isha behel is a instagram content creator and i love the way she does her eyes so i asked her about it and she recommended this k beauty liquid liner it's in the shade grunge raisin and it's brown i've never had a brown um, eyeliner before and I was like hey how is that gonna work but it gives you like the most natural winged look and K-Beauty products are known to be like very good quality and quite affordable so I was excited to try it out and it didn't disappoint let me show you it's very precise the brush which I like so you can make it as thin as you want or you can build it up do you see that like it's not a very stark cat eye sometimes if you want to do like a very subtle look like oh this I wish I came to know about brown eyeliner before because this is gorgeous. I, like I absolutely love it. So um, yeah, if you're looking for a liquid, if you're looking for a liquid eyeliner, um, this lasts pretty well. It's quite pigmented. Um, I love the packaging. I love the brush. Um, and I love the color most of all because it's beautiful. So it's in the shade Grunge Raisin, like I told you. It's a very good buy. So that's it. I think 99% um, of the things that were recommended turned out to be really good so thank you for that if there's anything else you'd want me to try out let me know in the comments i won't buy it immediately i'll buy it after three months because you know i <laughs> i don't want to keep buying new products every single month and like waste it so let me know i'll keep looking at the comments and i will keep making a list and the next three months i will buy something and try it out also someone in the comments in my previous videos had mentioned that um whether i could do the video in natural lighting because i was using um, like artificial light uh, and probably that's why you couldn't see the shades clearly so i've taken your feedback into consideration i'm now filming in front of a window i hope that you can see the shades clearly the <laughs> uh only thing is my background is not as aesthetic because i live in a one bedroom house so um i don't have much space to film in uh, but i hope that this video helped and that um if you are looking to uh buy any of these products that you were able to get some insight into it and uh, yeah if there's anything else you want me to try let me know in the comments and i will see you soon in the next video bye oh and if you haven't subscribed yet and you're watching this video please subscribe because it's very helpful okay thanks bye